So I had this issue where I undid this line on my kayak rudder right here. These go in your rudder and they adjust it based on your foot pegs. But this line right here needs to be adjustable in case you move your foot pegs. Well, I undid this knot. I have no idea why I did it and I couldn't remember how to do it. So I'm gonna retrace it right now. I'm still learning this knot, so forgive me. So we got this, we're gonna make our two loops and I'm gonna use my fingers. So one, two, we got our two. We're gonna go, are we gonna go under or are we gonna go over? We're gonna go over this line, okay? Through the hole, get some footage here and go back through your two holes again, your two loops. Then you're gonna grab it like this and kind of cinch it down like that. And this will be adjustable. We need it to be adjustable because it has to go through these two holes, wrap around, and when we move the foot pegs, we have to pull this line to tighten or loosen the knot, okay? So here's how we're gonna do it. We grab our line. We're gonna go, keep our fingers out like this. We're gonna go one, we're gonna go two, okay? We're gonna wrap it all the way around. We're gonna go, okay, that's three, sorry. After the second one, we're gonna go over, this is the important part, over the line, into the two holes, kind of grab it like that get ourselves some footage, wrap it, go back through the two holes. Now this is the part that we want. That's the shape we want. And we're gonna kind of grab it like this, give ourselves some space and just kind of cinch it down just like that. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna install our rudder line. So we're gonna go through this hole, okay? We're gonna wrap it around just like that. Same thing on the other side. And this makes it quick to uninstall the rudder as well, which is very nice. So through the holes, over, and then you cinch it down, just like that, boom. Okay, here's why this is important. We're gonna move over here. Say we wanna adjust, let's say we're right here, okay? And we're right, so that's number two. We wanna be right there. Now look, our feet, when we do this, is doing nothing to the rudder, right? So what we wanna do is come over to the rudder and we wanna make it straight. And then we're just gonna pull these adjustable lines. Oops, this one came out. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna kinda of pull these lines to see about where it needs to be without putting too much pressure. We don't wanna pull the actual foot peg. So we know that tension right there is good. So we'll kind of pull it a little bit more, a little tighter, just like that for some fine tune adjustment. And then we will put, put this one on like that. And on the other side, same thing. We're gonna kind of see the pressure of our foot peg, which seems to be right about there, but that's too much. So we need to pull out the slack just like that. It's still a little bit too much. Again, I'm feeling the the, foot peg to see how much pressure is on it. <laughs> Sorry, that's my son. And then we're gonna take it like that. Bingo. So now, if we go over back here to the foot pegs, you can see if I do this, it moves it. And if I do this, it moves it. And now we have full adjustable rudder. And so again, guys, that's why that knot is important. And I hope this knot helps you because I was just in a pinch trying to figure out this whole knot situation.